Okay, this is my my chaffle, my chaffle, um, and then I'm eating it up at the moment on my stove. Then I'm going to take my bread, and then I'm going to cut my bread. I already started to cut it a nice round shape. Then I'm going to take the butter, and then I'm going to spread it into the chaffle pan or you can just use a pastry brush after that I'm also going to margarine or butter the bread from the outside to prevent it from sticking then I'm going to add my filling my leftover butter chicken I had Now I will just close it. I just close it nice and tight. Now back on the stove, so for five minutes each side, and then it will be ready. Then I will show it to you. I just want you to listen to the sound it's making. I turned it the other way around. Um, you can also put it on the outside on your barbecue grill. That's what most people did back in the days and still doing now. Okay, I'm just gonna open it now and slowly. Opening it. Give it a little bit of a help. That's why it's important to have the oil sprayed on. Okay. Let me see. All done. Okay. I think I'm going to have a bite. It's a little bit hot still. Don't you don't know if you can hear how crunch it is? Juicy, and you have your favorite filling, you know what you're eating. All handmade, very economical. So I bought my Jeffel pan from Second Hand Shop. Um maybe you can look online perhaps or at your local um thrift shops, you might find it there. Enjoy. Bye.